What's up everybody, Remington from Impulse Creative. And today we're gonna to talk about how to integrate Drift into Google Analytics and what kind of information you can get out of both systems. So integrating with Google Analytics and Drift is incredibly easy. Literally, you can do it with one click. So I'm gonna jump in, show you how to do that, but then we're gonna jump into Google Analytics and we're gonna understand some of the things that you can do in order to start tracking the effectiveness of your live chat and the chat bots that are on your website. So first thing to do is we're going to integrate into Google Analytics. Of course, you need to be logged into your Google Analytics account and you would also need to be in the settings tab of your Drift portal. So when you go to settings, which is the gear off to the left, you would then click apps. And as you scroll down, you'll see Google Analytics about halfway down on the page. Go ahead and click into that and you'll see a Google Analytics with a green connect button. All you have to do is click connect. There are some advanced options. This is only needed if you have multiple Google Analytics tracking plugins on your site. But now that you see the connected button, that's all you've got to do. So when we go over to Google Analytics, of course, you would have to have some traffic before these events would start to show up. You will see events and how you get there is when you're in your individual Google Analytics web property, you're going to see all your items off to the left. You can go under behavior and then you will see events. When you scroll down to those events, you can choose top events or you could go to particular pages, um, but you'll see three different types of events that Drift is going to be creating for you. You're going to have a chat started, an email captured, and a meeting's booked. Every time that a meeting is booked in, with your Drift chat widget, it will initiate this event in Google Analytics. So this can make it so that you can now dig into what specific pages are booking meetings or capturing emails. And of course you get a better idea of the overall health of your website when it comes to your live chat tool. So you can even take this at a higher level. If you go up to in, under the events dropdown, you go to overview, you'll be able to see there's a drift widget event category. This entire event category, of course, would be the drill down of those three events that I just talked about. But you can start to see where the drift widget was firing at all throughout your website. You can also use a secondary dimension to identify where these pages are from a report perspective. And so when you're in your Drift widget, for instance, we're gonna wanna see the, the three events that happen there. You can click secondary dimension, you can choose acquisition, for instance, and you can say source or medium, as an example. When you click source or medium, what it'll do is it will show you each of those event actions, and it'll show you the source of where things came from. So for instance, organic traffic, um, you know, a referral from another website, whether people have come in from YouTube, you know, whether they're coming from Facebook. So you'll be able to start seeing, you know, how many meetings books came from X source. And it allows for you to have a really high level overview of in specific to how your chats are being engaged, where that information is coming from. So that's it for today's tutorial. If you have any questions about conversational marketing or drift, we'd be happy to help. At Impulse Creative, we do a bunch of work helping clients deploy conversational marketing and then, of course, also track its effectiveness. So if you'd like to talk to one of us, please feel free to reach out on our website and we'd be happy to help you out. If you'd like to see other tutorials we've done, you can go ahead and you can do that right here. And of course, you can subscribe to our daily video tutorials by go ahead and clicking right here. Until next time, I'm Remington from Impulse Creative. Have a great day.